Hannes, welcome to, uh, to Burnley, to Burnley Football Club. How does it feel to be here? I'm very, very pleased to be here and uh, I can't wait to start. Let's, I think it'd be great just to, to find out a bit more about yourself. So we're looking, doing some research and you were born in Haiti and moved to Belgium, was it was age two? Yes. Yeah, it's a young age to, to move over. How was, how was that move? Um, actually, I don't remember anything no. about it anymore, <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, my parents, uh, they, uh, they took care of me and uh, I was really happy to be here and everything went um, good, actually, yeah. And then in terms of, of playing, you, you came through the, the ranks at Andalac, so from the, the academy and signed your first contract in January 2017 yeah. and made your senior debut in, in 2018. So if you could just talk to us a bit about your, your time at Andalac and your experience there. Um, yeah, like you said, I have yeah, been through almost all the youth and at under 15 I started um, and then, yeah, I skipped some some uh, uh, some teams, so, um, and then uh, yeah, I was quite fr uh, quite um, on time uh, for playing in the first team. Um, and actually, uh, it was a great time being there. Uh, also a good club, and uh, yeah, actually, it was it was a great time. And you spent some time on loan as well in in Holland. Yeah, yeah that's also true. Uh, I was on loan for one year um, in uh, Holland, RKC Waalwijk. And um, then I came back and then uh, I started playing uh, on the uh, company, actually, yeah. So talk, that leads us nicely into, into to Vincent and the manager here. So from your time at Andalek, you'll be very familiar with him. How did you find working with, with him and what conversations did he have with you about moving to Burnley? Um, yeah, when I was there, of course, uh, it's for me also uh, uh, yeah, very nice to, to have him as a coach because he was also a defender before and I learned uh, a lot of him. Um, and um, yeah, for, for me coming here now, it's also a big oppor opportunity and I can still progress uh, under him. And for me, it's also, uh, uh, I think, a good choice to, to come here. And, and from that as, as well, in terms of his backroom staff for, from Andalette that are here as well, you'll be familiar with, sort of, with Craig Bellamy, with, with Flo and the team as well. Does that help when, when settling at a new club, kind of having those familiar faces? Yeah, I think for sure it helps. Uh, I knew them very well and uh, it was a very great staff. And um, yeah, when you saw the leave, them leave, uh, it was really, yeah, it did something with you, of course, uh, because everybody left. Um, but then uh, when I can really, like, when I uh, arrive and I see the, the faces again, it was, it was like um, coming home a little bit, you know, and I, I knew them very good. So it was very nice to see them back. It's nice. It feels like coming home. Yeah. Re reunited. <laughs> yeah, reunited. That's what I mean. Yes. <laughs> and so again, from Andalak, like, you'll, you'll know Josh, Josh Cullen, and we saw you having a chat before. Did he have any kind of advice or words of wisdom for ahead of the move? Um, no, it's, it's actually the first time I heard him today, ah. um, but uh, yeah, I think uh, we can uh, still catch up about some things. Uh, but uh, yeah, he told me uh, that everything is great here and, and um, yeah, that people will help uh, whenever I need something and he will help me as well. So yeah, it's very good. And, and does that help in terms of sort of whether, yes, to know the playing staff and the backroom staff is great, but knowing a player as well in terms of knowing his playing style, does that help when settling into a club, having played with him before? Uh, yeah, of course, I know, I, I know just, just his qualities. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, I think for me as a player, of course, you want to understand all the players on the pitch. And um, yeah, I can already like, uh, uh, I think one, di one uh, down. Yeah, uh, one tick. <laughs> yeah, one tick. I can tick already one box uh, of a player, but um, yeah. So I, I, it takes time to, to understand the player as well, and uh, we will see how it goes. And so, has have the last kind of few hours been a bit of a whirlwind? If you talk us through the move, move here. <laughs> yeah, kind of. Um, yeah, I heard. Uh, I think it was a Monday or, or Tuesday um, that uh, that uh, Burnley was. Uh, yeah, interested in me, mm -hmm. and um, yeah, it went really quick. I had a phone call of Vinny, and and uh, and um, yeah, Saturday I was already on the plane, so it went very quick. Um, and I did the medical testing in the morning. Then I stayed at the hotel in Manchester, and um, yeah, Sunday it was a, a day off actually. I was there just yeah, a little bit, yeah, a little <laughs> bit visiting, and uh, 
Um, and yeah, today now I'm here. Uh, uh, I did the, uh, the the physical testing and everything went well. So it was a, a busy, uh, it were busy days, but I'm very happy to be here now. Good stuff. And in terms of, of Burnley and, and moving here, what are you most excited about, about joining the club? Um, of course, uh, it's a different competition. Uh, the Premier League, everybody knows it. Uh, I think uh, we, uh, it's the best uh, competition in the world at the moment. So um, for me, it's a big opportunity to come here, and yeah, especially uh, also the team. It, it's yeah, it's a great team, um, and uh, yeah, really, uh, it was not uh, difficult for me to come here when I got this option, of course. Yeah. <laughs> and you, you've had experience in terms of playing um, Premier League opposition. So you played last season West Ham twice in the Europa uh, League. Yes, true. So, from from that experience, what would you take from it, kind of going into a Premier League campaign? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. To be honest, uh, when we were in the Conference League, uh, we knew against which teams we were about to play, and I was really like, I really want to play in West Ham. Yeah. I, I was really <laughs> like this. Of course, you want to play every game, but this was really something I wanted to to do. And um, yeah, it's from from there on, you know, it's a it's a different category, and uh, you see the stadium, you see. Um, the quality of the players and uh, yeah, this is also this was also something like if I can ever play in the Premier League, uh, yeah, it's uh, like a dream coming true. Yeah, do you, do you feel a certain buzz in the, the sort of the Premier League, the stadium, yeah, the atmosphere, yeah, and yeah. people's passion for it? Yeah, you see, it's really different than in Belgium. That uh, yeah. And in terms of your international career, so you've played for um, for Belgium from the under 15s through to the under 21s, and then when you made your senior debut in in 2020 against Switzerland. I did, uh, like you said, uh, all the youth international team, and then for me, um, being able to make my debut in the first team, um, yeah, it was also a, yeah, really uh, actually also like a dream <laughs> that came true. So um, yeah, that's it. A dream come true, and. You're a defender, so what kind of characteristics uh, would you say that you have as, as a player? What can Burnley fans expect from you? Um, honestly, I don't like to talk <laughs> <laughs> uh, too much about myself, but um, <laughs> yeah, for me, I think I'm someone who, who, who likes learning a lot and um, on, I, I think I'm quite calm on the ball, but yeah, I think uh, you all will see uh, what my qualities are. We'll, we'll find out. Yes. <laughs> we'll yes. find out soon. Yeah. And let's talk a bit about you yourself away from football, that aside. What sort of, how would you kind of describe yourself and what sort of things do you like doing away from football? Um, I'm um, kind of more introvert guy. Um, I, I, of course, I, I, it takes time to open up, uh, but for me, uh, I'm always calm. Um, I'm kind, <laughs> no, but uh, yeah, no. And, and uh, in the yeah, in my free time, I like uh, playing the piano, um, and uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, it's a good talent. Yeah. Also, if we could bring a piano in, could we hear a few tunes course, from you? We could course, get if you have one. Uh, <laughs> we, have, yeah, yeah. Go, we can make some calls. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Well, welcome to Burnley and we look forward to seeing you get started. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you.